Hi, this is Jenny Pannebecker with Virginia Tech University Libraries. Um, this video will cover um, some, one way to accomplish the assignment for Neuroscience 1004 using PubMed to explore topic research trends, um, looking at the number of publications per year on a given topic. So if your example topic, um, we'll use this example topic for this video. If you needed to use PubMed to determine how many studies have explored a link between BPA or plastics and cancer since 1990, and then also download the resulting CSV file from PubMed to create a graph, and print the graph. Um, we'll see how you can do that. So from PubMed, you can do a search on our topic. So we're looking at um, studies that have explored a link between BPA or plastics and cancer. So by putting our first concept um, where we want one of either of two things, BPA or plastics in parentheses, we let PubMed know that we want any one from this group plus um, cancer in our results. So then if we search for these keywords, we get these results here and you see the total number of results here you also see the number of results by year. And then if I zoom this out a little bit, you can see that there's a link to download the CSV file for this graph of results per year. Um, you'll also see that I already had the publication date limit set to 1990. Um, so if you didn't have that set, which you probably don't have already, you can click on custom range and search for publications from a given date um, starting with the year January 1st, apply that, and that will make your results show only the publications from that date on. Then um, for your assignment for Neuroscience 1004, you want to download the CSV file um, if you have Safari, you may need to right-click and then choose to download the linked file. Once you've done that, you can go to your Downloads folder or find Downloads on your computer and open your CSV file. And then we'll zoom this in a little bit. Okay, so now we have here we're going to select the year and count get all this information here and then we'll click on the charts option and choose the scatter chart from Excel. Once we've done that it shows the amount by each year here and we can change this to any other kind of chart such as a bar graph showing the number per year. You can also change the title on your chart. So PubMed results 1990 on BPA or plastics and cancer, for example. And then once you have this set, you can um, right click and save this as a picture. You could also use file print in Excel to print both the numbers and the chart. Um, I would use the page setup to change your orientation to landscape and to choose to fit all the information on one page wide by one page tall. So you have the graph and the data next to it. So those are a couple options that you can do to um, save either just the chart or print all that information. And if you have, um, so your assigned topic is to do the same kind of thing, but look at how many studies have explored a link between mercury or lead and autism.
since 1990. So then you want to also download the resulting CSV file from PubMed, um, use it to create a graph, and print the graph. And if you have questions about this, you can use the Ask a Librarian feature on the library homepage or contact me by email or phone vpannabe at vt.edu or 540-231-7980. Have a great day.